I'm an average rugby coach and it struck me that running a hire business must be very similar to running a rugby team. You need solid, dependable workers. You need those who can work lightly on their feet. You need a boss who's in charge and knows where you're going. If you're going to get better and grow, you need the right equipment and you need the right people to help to go and get it. Hi, I'm Rich Corson, Corson Business Finance, and I'm here at my rugby club, Hinkley RFC, and I'm going to be talking about supporting and expanding your hire business. Rental and hire is big business, particularly for high ticket items like vans, trailers, plant and machinery. To make sure you've got enough customers to make some more profit, it's important that you don't drop the ball and invest in new kit. So what do you do now? when money's getting tight, especially now with rising interest rates. Here's four tips for how you can help fund your hire business. Whether you're looking to score a little cash to, for some new equipment or some unexpected build, you can always tackle it with a loan. The good news is that there's plenty of funders out there that you can choose from. The bad news is that it can be a bit of a scrum trying to find the right funder for your requirements. <laughs> so you might have to do lots of work just trying to get the, uh, get the finance facilities approved. And there's lots of other business critical tasks vying for your attention, which leads us quickly to... There is an inherent risk to hiring things out and nobody understands this better than banks and financial institutions. Unfortunately, that does mean that sometimes they're not keen to lend to organisations who are in the business of hiring things themselves. You need to make sure that your contracts are rocking watertight. And what that does mean is that when it comes time for a sub-hire audit or your documentation to be checked, then you need the finance companies to know you're absolutely on solid ground with a game-winning strategy. There are other challenges to hire companies that means finding the right finance solution can be a trying experience. You're likely to have more gearing, which means that you've got more loans in your business than you have your own money invested. You probably only want to put in a low deposit into the deal, which then means that you can match the income coming in through your rentals to the expenses going out on the finances. That means that you're not strapping up your business too much. These aren't exactly the most appealing circumstances financially for most lenders so you'll need to find one that understands your circumstances well so as they won't give your application the red card. So how do you stay on the ball when it comes to making your finance application? Talk to the experts. Of course in business finance we've got the funders and the expertise to make sure we pass the application onto somebody who will say yes. That way you get the cash that you need for your new gear and no penalties. We'll coach you through the entire finance process and we'll get to know your business needs inside out. We know we've got all the information that we need to get your finance application converted. To find out more about how you can score a great deal for your business then head on over to our website and fill in the contact us page on the, online. Either that or give us a call at the office and one of our experts will be more than happy to pitch in. We're looking forward to being a part of your team soon. I hope that gives you an idea how Course from Business Finance can serve you as a hire business. Don't forget in the meantime to like, share and subscribe on our YouTube channel. I've been Rich Corson, Corson Business Finance. Thanks for watching.